dragon! It's attacking! It flew over the town and landed on the old dragon burial mound. I don't know what it's doing up there, but I'm not waiting around to find out. you some answers, don't I? Go ahead. Whatever you want to know. Nothing held back. Not a damn thing. I was just as surprised as you to find that big black dragon here. Really? Where? Interesting. Same dragon. Damn it! We're blundering around in the dark here. We need to figure out who's behind it all. I'm one of the last members of the Blades. A very long time ago, the Blades were Dragon Slayers, and we served the Dragonborn, the greatest Dragon Slayer. For the last 200 years since the last Dragonborn Emperor, the Blades have been searching for a purpose. Now that dragons are coming back, our pur The first thing we need to do is figure out who's behind the dragons. The Thalmor are our best lead. If they aren't involved, they'll know who is. The faction that rules the Aldmeri Dominion, the ones who almost destroyed the Empire during the Great War 30 years back. There's no worse enemy to humankind in Tamriel. The Empire barely survived the last war. The Thalmor don't intend to lose the next one. Nothing solid, yet. But my gut tells me it can't be anybody else. The Empire had captured Ulfric. The war was basically over. Then a dragon attacks, Ulfric escapes, and the war is back on. And now the dragons are attacking everywhere, indiscriminately. Skyrim is weakened. The Empire is weakened. Who else gains from that but the Thalmor? 
Before the Great War, the Blades helped the Empire against the Thalmor. Our Grand Master saw them as the greatest threat to Tamriel. At the time, that was true. Maybe it still is. So we fought them in the shadows, all across Tamriel. We thought we were more than a match for them. We were wrong. If we could get into the Thalmor Embassy, it's the center of their operations in Skyrim. Problem is, that place is locked up tighter than a miser's purse. They could teach me a few things about paranoia. Hmm, I'm not sure yet. I have a few ideas, but I'll need some time to pull things together. Meet me back in Riverwood. If I'm not back when you get there, wait for me. I shouldn't be long. Keep an eye on the sky. This is only going to get worse. Still here. I'll head back home if you need me. Honor to you, my pain. I don't think you were followed. Come on, I have a plan. I figured out how we're going to get you into the Thalmor Embassy. That would be a bad idea. I'd be too likely to attract the wrong kind of attention. But they don't know you at all yet. The Thalmor Ambassador, Elenwen, regularly throws parties where the rich and connected cozy up to the Thalmor. I can get you into one of those parties. Once you're inside the Embassy, you can get away and find Elenwen's secret files. I have a contact inside the embassy. He's not up for this kind of high-risk mission, but he can help you. His name is Malborn. Wood Elf. Plenty of reason to hate the Thalmor. You can trust him. I'll get word for him to meet you in solitude at the Winking Skeever. You know it? While you're doing that, I'll work on getting you an invitation to Ellen Wynn's little party. Meet me at the Solitude Stables after you've arranged things with Malborn. Any questions? Sounds good. Be careful. What? Something you're still confused about?
there some gold for a veteran? This one's a favorite of mine. A legend we hmm? all know and love. Really? You're who she picked? I hope she knows what she's doing. Here's the deal. I can smuggle some equipment into the embassy for you. Don't plan on bringing anything else in with you. The Thalmor takes security very seriously. Give me what you can't live without, and I'll make sure to get it into the embassy. The rest is up to you. Okay, I'll get this inside the embassy for you. I've got to go. I'll find you at the party. Don't worry. Your job is to get into the party without being fingered as a spy. I'll take care of the rest. Have you given Malborn the gear you want to smuggle into the embassy? Good. I have your invitation to the party. But the only way you're going to get past the guards is if they really believe you're an invited guest. Which means you need to look the part and not be armed to the teeth. Here, put this on. When you're ready, I'll keep the rest of your gear safe until you get back. You'll only have what Malborn smuggled in for you, plus whatever you can pick up inside. You can't go to a party at the Thalmor Embassy dress- Like that. I guess that will have to do. You should pass for a real guest, at least until you open your mouth. You ready to board the carriage to the Embassy? Don't worry, it will all be waiting for you when you get back. Just make sure you get back out of there alive with the information we need. Good luck. Welcome to the Tholmore Embassy. Your invitation, please? Thank you, sir. Go right in. I prefer to arrive. Now then, here's my invitation. Welcome. I don't believe we've met. I am Elinwyn, the Thalmor Ambassador to Skyrim. And you are? Ah, yes. I remember your name from the guest list. 
Please, tell me more about yourself. What brings you to this... <laughs> to Skyrim? What is it, Malborn? It's just that we've run out of the Alto wine. Do I have your permission to uncork the... Of course. I've told you before not to bother me with such trifles. Yes, Madam Ambassador. My apologies. We'll have to get better acquainted later. Please, enjoy yourself. What can I get for you? You made it in. Good. As soon as you distract the guards, I'll open this door and we can get you on your way. Let's hope we both live through this day. Here you go, sir. The finest Colovian brandy. Is there anything else I can get for you? Of course. Let me see if we have another bottle of that. I'll be waiting by the door for everyone to be distracted. What is a fellow? What does a fellow need to do to get a drink around here? Ah, the one generous soul amongst a gathering of pinch pennies and lick spittles! If there's anything I can ever do for you, do not hesitate to call upon me. Wonderful! I can begin to repay your generosity immediately. Say on, friend. Is that all? <laughs> My friend, you've come to the right person. You could say that causing a scene is somewhat of a specialty of mine. Stand back and behold my handiwork. It pleases me to hear you say so. Attention, everyone! Could I have your attention, please? Yes, what do you need? Farewell. Let's go, let's go! Before anyone notices us! And when our mistress... What are you doing? I speak figuratively, of course. Ugh. Nothing could be more unlikely than that someone would actually want her in their bed. Although, most of you are already in bed with... But again... So far, so... We need to pass through the kitchen. Fine, Your gear fine. is hidden Get in the larder. Just I'll stay close and let me do any talking. Got it? Follow me. Come, Malburn. You know I don't like strange way. smells in my kitchen. A guest feeling ill. Leave the poor wretch be. A guest? In the kitchens? You know this is against the rules. Rules, is it, Zabani? I didn't realize that eating moon sugar was permitted. Perhaps I should ask the ambassador. Get out of here. I saw nothing. Your gear is in that chest. I'll lock the door behind you. Don't screw this up. Come on. If someone misses me at the party, we're both dead. Is the food and drink to your liking? Did you Good see luck. those robes much in your own morning? Who are they with? More of the emissaries. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
I told you. I don't know anything else about it. What? Who... what... what do you want, then? Yeah, sure. Uh, okay. Come on, this way. I've seen the guards use it to get rid of bodies. It must lead somewhere. <sighs> Whatever you want. But let's go, now. I saw guards dragging bodies over here. Might be a way out. Listen up, spy. You're trapped in here, and we have your accomplice. Surrender immediately, or you both die. Let's Never get out of here. Never should have come here. Now the Thalmor will be hunting me for the rest of my life. I hope it was worth it. You didn't have to help me, so thanks. You didn't have to help me, so thanks. Fandal thinks he can woo Camilla Valerius away from me. She's already mine, I'm telling you. Riverwood's agreeable enough, I suppose. For a Nord village. He 
You're kind of fuzzy. What's wrong with you? You made it out alive, at least. Your gear is safe in my room, as promised. Did you learn anything useful? Really? That seems hard to believe. You're sure about that. You're right, you're right. I just... I was sure it must have been them. If not the Thalmor, who? Or what? Give me a moment. Hesburn? He's alive? Coming right up. I thought the Thalmor must have got him years ago. <laughs> that crazy old man. Figures the Thalmor would be on his trail, though, if they were trying to find out what's going on with the dragons. You mean aside from wanting to kill every blade they can lay their hands on? Esbern was one of the Blade's archivists, back before the Thalmor smashed us during the Great War. He knew everything about the ancient dragon lore of the Blades. Obsessed with it, really. Nobody paid much attention back then. I guess he wasn't as crazy as we all thought. Ironic, right? The old enemies assumed that every calamity must be a plot by the other side. Even so, we've got to find Esbern before they do. He'll know how to stop the dragons if anybody does. Do they know where he is? Riften, eh? Probably down in the Ratway, then. It's where I'd go. You'd better get to Riften. Talk to Brynjolf. He's well-connected. A good starting point, at least. Oh, and when you find Esbern, if you think I'm paranoid, you may have some trouble getting him to trust you. Just ask him where he was on the 30th of Frostfall. He'll know what it means. The Blades have always guarded and guided the Dragonborn, but we'd forgotten why. Now our purpose is clear. I'm all that's left of the Blades, and you're the Dragonborn. Together, we're going to stop these dragons if we have to put every last one of them back in the ground. What do you need, Dragonborn?
Can I help you? finally came to your senses. Ready to make some coin? Ah, expecting free information, eh? Help me deal with business first, then we'll see how I can help you. Besides, you look like your pockets are a little light on coin. Am I right? Passing on a golden opportunity is worse. Until next we meet, lad. Simple. I'm going to cause a distraction. You're gonna steal Medesi's silver ring from a strong box under a stand. Once you have it, I want you to place it in Branche's pocket without him noticing. There's someone that wants to see him put out of business permanently. That's all you need to know. Now, you tell me when you're ready, and we'll get started. Good. Wait until I start the distraction, then show me what you're made of. Everyone, everyone, gather round. I have something amazing to show you that demands your attention. This way, everyone, over here.
shoving. Plenty of room. person for the job. And here you go. Your payment. Just as I promised. The way things have been going around here, it's a relief that our plan went off without a hitch. Ah, my organization's been having a run of bad luck, but I suppose that's just how it goes. But never mind that. You did the job, and you did it well. Best of all, there's more where that came from. If you think you can handle it. Look, I'll make this simple for you. The group I represent has its home in the Ratway beneath Riften, a tavern called the Ragged Flagon. When you make up your mind, come find me there, and we'll talk about your future. What is it with you and all these questions? Yeah, I bet I know your guy. He's hiding out in the Ratway Warrens, paying us good coin for nobody to know about it. All right, Grand Shay. Turn out your pockets. Come, Come back, honey. You look like you could use a drink. What do you say to some cheap meat? Those days are over. I'm telling you. Huh? There's the pl Can't hide from me! The Thalmor's memory is gone.
your worst! That's not me. I'm not Esben. I don't know what you're talking about. Delphine? How do you... So you finally found her. And she led you to me. And here I am, caught like a rat in a trap. Delphine? How do you... Well, this is just a trick to get me to open the door, huh? I told you to go away. I told you to go away. I'm not opening this door for anybody. Ah, indeed. Indeed. Uh, I do remember. Delphine really is alive, then. You'd better come in, then, and tell me how you found me, and what you want. Th this'll just take a moment. This one always fits. There we go. Only a couple more. There we are. Come in, come in. Make yourself at home. That's better. Now we can talk. So... Delphine keeps up the fight after all these years. I thought she'd have realized it's hopeless by now. I tried to tell her years ago. Haven't you figured it out yet? What more needs to happen before you all wake up and see what's going on? Aldwin has returned just like the prophecy said. The dragon from the dawn of time who devours the souls of the dead. No one can escape his hunger. Here or in the afterlife, Alduin will devour all things, and the world will end. Nothing can stop him. Ah, I tried to tell them. They wouldn't listen. Fools. It's all come true. All I could do was watch our doom approach. Yes, yes. You see, you know, but you refuse to understand. Oh, yes. It's all been foretold. The end has begun. Aldrin has returned. Only a dragonborn can stop him. 
but no dragonborn has been known for centuries. It seems that the gods have grown tired of us. They've left us to our fate as the plaything of Aldwin the World Eater. What? You are? Can it really be true? Dragonborn? Then, then there is hope. The gods have not abandoned us. We must, we must, no. we must go quickly now. Take me to Delphine. We have much to discuss. Give me just a moment. I must gather a few things. I'll need... Uh, no. No useless trash. Where'd I put my annotated annual? One moment. I know time is of the essence, but must leave secrets for the Thalmor. There's one more I must bring. Um, well... I guess that's good enough. Let's be off. Hey, did you say something? Yes, yes. We should proceed cautiously. I'm gonna eat well tonight, my <laughs> darling. Who's there?
did you need something? Should keep. Delphine, <laughs> I, it's good to see you. It's been a long time. It's good to see you too, Esbern. It's been too long, old friend. Too long. Well, then. You made it safe and sound. Good. Come on, I have a place we can talk. Orgnar, hold down the bar for a minute, will you? Yeah, sure. This way. Let's see what Esbern has to say. Now then, I assume you know about... Oh yes, Dragon Ball, indeed, yes. Oh, this changes everything, of course. There's no time to lose, so we must locate. Let me show you. I know I had it here somewhere. Esbern, what? Give me just a moment. Oh. Ah, here it is. Come, let me... You see, right here, Skyhaven Temple. Constructed around one of the main Akaviri military camps in the Reach, during their conquest of Skyrim. Do you know what he's talking about? Shh! This is where they built Aldrin's Wall, to set down and stone all their accumulated dragon lore. A hedge against the forgetfulness of centuries. A wise and foresighted policy, in the event. Despite the far-reaching fame of Aldwin's Wall at the time, one of the wonders of the ancient world, its location was lost. Esbern, what are you getting at? You mean, you don't mean to say you haven't heard of Aldwin's Wall? Either of you? Let's pretend we haven't. What's Aldwin's Wall, and what does it have to do with stopping the dragons? Aldwin's Wall was where the ancient blades recorded all they knew of Alduin and his return. Part history, part prophecy. His location has been lost for centuries, but I've found it again. 
Not lost, you see, just forgotten. The Blades archives held so many secrets. I was only able to save a few scraps. So you think that Alduin's wall will tell us how to defeat Alduin? Well, yes. But there's no guarantee, of course. Skyhaven Temple it is, then. I knew you'd have something for us, Esbern. I know the area of the reach that Esbern's talking about, near what's now known as Carthspire in the Carth River Canyon. We can meet you there or all travel together. Your call. Your call. Might be safer to travel separately. Attract less attention that way. Don't worry, I'll get Esbern there in one piece. We'll wait for you near Carthspire. Good luck. <laughs>